I want to make sure you do not miss out on any free to play stones during part two of this global Frosty Dokkan campaign. So to start things off, we have the special missions from part two here. So you have one, three, six, and 12 dragon stones from the part two missions if you complete all of them. Then we have this new prime battle LRTN event, which some of you may have already started grinding. There's no missions that come attached to this event. It's pretty bare bones. You can get actually three free to play dragon zones from this because clearing a new stage gets you a dragon stone. And that's exactly what it is. You clear uh, level one, level two and level three for the first time and you get up to three free to play stones from that. So that puts us at 15 dragon stones so far for part two. And then we also have the Extreme Z battle coming up here on the 21st. This Extreme Z battle for the LR Tech Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black and Zamasu. If we go down here for completing this mission, you get three Dragon Stones. So that puts us at 18. And then you get a Dragon Stone for completing, or actually three Dragon Stones, because there's only 10 levels for an LR EZA. Three Dragon Stones for completing each stage. So up to 30 there. So that puts us at 48 Dragon Stones so far. And it's the same exact thing with the Extreme Z battle for the LR, STR, Shrunks, and Mai. Same mission, clear stage seven once. You get three Dragon Stones there. So that puts us at 51 total. And then 30 Dragon Stones for completing all the stages, stages one through 10. And then that puts us at 81 Dragon Stones right there. And then there's one more thing. We are getting a new Peton battle here the 16th peton battle which will show up on the 21st as well and you usually get around 20 dragon stones there so that puts us at 101 free to play dragon stones for you to grab potentially and keep in mind and i say this every single video that i make about dragon stones and being able to farm them up this is a potential amount there may be some events that i may be missing and there may be some events that you cannot do at this time because you don't have the correct units or the correct team such as the extreme d battles you may not have teams to finish these extreme d battles so these are potential free to play stones up for grabs for you so 101 total so far and then we're getting the special login bonus here. Off we go, an exciting camping trip. The same one we got during the worldwide celebration from the 22nd of December to the 31st. I'm not going to count the free to play stones because it's all RNG. It's luck. As you log in, you'll see an animation where Gohan chops some wood. I, I think there's like three different tiers where you get an assorted amount of items. But the first tier, you get one dragon stone and some other items. The second tier, you get three dragon stones and some other items and then the third tier if you get lucky enough you get seven dragon stones and a bunch of other items like hercule statues training items and all that good stuff keys meats i think i think you get meats from this i'm not going to count that because it's completely luck complete rng it's not going to be a definitive amount that you can get from this and then we also have the login bonus for the frosty dogon campaign itself which in the first video I made, I did count all the stones there. So I'm not going to count them in this one, but you do get a total of 36 free to play stones from the login bonus from logging in every single day during the Frosty Dokkan campaign. So you want to make sure you're logging in every day if you want to take advantage of getting the most amount of free to play stones you can get during this campaign. And yeah, that's about it. I'll catch you on the next one.